last thing would be a dominant dog collar. Um, it's just a really thin slip leash. If, he, if it's really severe, that's the best way to de-escalate a dog, especially if they've bitten and they haven't let him go. If you ever look at like protection dogs, mm -hmm. like I got like bit by one of the protection dogs. I was in the <laughs> suit, you know, I was in the suit. I just tried it for the first time. Pretty frightening. For like but, the canine training? Yeah, yeah, I did some freaking canine training, you know, I was in the suit. And sometimes, you know, it's not the best, but sometimes they have to choke the dog off of the bite. Oh my gosh. You know, they're yeah. trying, like I was getting bit by one of the dogs. Yeah. And I was, and it was pretty painful. And I was like, oh, can you let the dog like release me now, please? <laughs> <You> know, <laughs> like, I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. I'm out. This is good enough for me. And the guy, like the first dog, they said out. It didn't respond. They used the e-collar a couple times and the dog finally let go. I was mm -hmm. like, okay, thank God. Yeah. The second dog, the dog was just thrashing on me and they were like, out, out. It wasn't working. So the guy had to use the dominant dog collar and pulled the dog. Uh -huh. and, he, and the guy literally went like this. And the dog immediately let go. E collar wasn't gonna help me. He tried. He was trying. <laughs> it wasn't working, you know. So he had to like physically use the dominant dog collar, gently pull up, and the dog was like, and just came off. <laughs> Beautiful.